The pandemic may be behind us, but it's not completely over. That's especially true for a local TriMet worker who's waiting now for a double lung transplant after coming down with the virus. The family will have to relocate for the procedure and the treatment. Fox News Bridget Chavez spoke with the man's wife and shares their story. His lungs are scarred. There's too much inflammation and they cannot recover um, without a, I mean, he needs a lung transplant. Bill West first tested positive for COVID-19 in April. He was then admitted to the hospital for treatment. Not long after, things took a turn for the worse. I mean, he's, he's struggling for his life and it has changed our life forever. Helen West tells me her husband wanted to get vaccinated. By the time he was gonna do it, he was already sick. Her message to everyone, get your shot. It is not something that when people get COVID should take lightly. There are only a handful of hospitals on the West Coast that can perform the double lung transplant. So when he does undergo the procedure, the family will have to move to Seattle or the Bay Area. I, I don't know what the outcome is gonna be. And frankly, <laughs> Um, I'm I'm really angry. It's very upsetting to me that people don't see this side of COVID. But despite it all, Helen says Bill is in good spirits. And he's very strong. He's he hasn't complained once. He's so kind to the nurses and everyone. He just <laughs> he thanks everybody for every time his machine goes off. He has to, he says thanks, thanks, buddy. Bridget Chavez, Fox 12, Oregon. The family has set up a GoFundMe to help pay for medical costs and move. We posted that online at kptv.com.